Hi folks, I'm Steve Hindy for Showing Animals Respect and Kindness. Time for an update on our Crush Cockfighting campaign. A lot's been happening. We've added a couple new pits to our long and growing list. One is in Vulcan, West Virginia, in Mingo County. We called the West Virginia State Police on this location on December 17th, and those officers broke up a planned cockfight, with the animal abusers running out like the cowards they are. The second location is outside Stanford, Kentucky, in Lincoln County. Kentucky State Police Post 7 responded to our call on January 14th. Again, the cockfighters were gone when the police got there. Somehow, these guys are getting the word about the police. We didn't put word out to our quick response list for either of these locations because both the West Virginia State Police and Kentucky State Police Post 7 have been responsive in the past, and they were again in these cases. Thank you, officers, for doing your job. We get word out to our quick response team for places where the police are not responsive, or more to the point, where they're corrupt. Lee County, Mississippi, for instance, has a very corrupt sheriff, Jim H. Johnson, a real piece of work. Sheriff Johnson's office has claimed that he won't bust cockfighting because it is only a misdemeanor. Only a misdemeanor? So what is a misdemeanor? Well, according to CriminalDefenseLawyer.com, misdemeanors include crimes such as assault, domestic violence, and child abuse. And these are not worthy crimes for Sheriff Johnson's attention? The blog site Animals 24-7 recounted how in 2017, Sheriff Johnson became unhappy with a Mississippi state representative during discussions about the conditions of the Lee County Jail. Speaking of the rep, Johnson emailed an ally, he's worse than a black person. I think that pretty well frames the kind of law enforcement we're dealing with in the Lee County Sheriff's Department. Sheriff Jim H. Johnson is both a corrupt cop, a racist, and generally he's just a really rotten human being. Before long, we'll be back in Mississippi to give Sheriff Johnson another dose of exposure, and I surely will appreciate your help at that time. We have lots of dates coming up where we'll be activating our quick response list. If you want to play a personal role in shutting down cockfights and supporting our frontline efforts, please let us know with an email to info at sharkonline.org. Stay tuned for much more action on our Crush Cockfighting campaign. Thank you for your continued support. I'm Steve Hindy for Showing Animals Respect and Kindness, and together we're going to crush cockfighting. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel to see more of our investigations and learn what you can do to help shark help animals. Consider sharing our videos so other people can help save lives. If you'd like to support Shark directly, you can follow the donation link in the description section of this video. If you'd like to gain access to exclusive content, consider sponsoring us on Patreon.